YouTube, what's up? I am uh, Jeroen Petri, also known as Guitar Insights. And today, I want to talk to you about this one uh, I have, my guitar. It's a BC Rich Warlock BK Bronze 2. And what that means is, of course, BC Rich is the brand, Warlock is the series. Uh, BK is, of course, that stands for black, so it's a black guitar. Bronze means it's the cheapest series, because you, in BC Rich you have bronze, platinum, signature, and of course, custom shop. And two means the model of the guitar. Um, so let's go uh, through the features first. Um, this guitar has a I got this body with a maple neck. Um, other than that, it has a rosewood fingerboard with 24 frets and standard dot inlays, as you can see. Uh, you have two BC Rich humbuckers right here and a wraparound bridge. Um, you got your basic features here also as a, um, a volume knob, a tone knob, and a three-way selector switch. Switch between uh, the bridge, both, or the neck pickup. Um, the jack input is right here, and um, I'm going to turn it on the guitar right now. And as you can see, it's a bolt on construction. Um, here goes the strap around, and uh, I'm going to flip it back over again. Up here, of course, we have the famous uh, B series headstock, which is called the Widow headstock, um, with some standard tuners, nothing really fancy. Um, so I'm going to show you a little bit about the sound right now. I'm going to start off with, of course, um, metal with the metal sound, of course, because this guitar is made for metal. So I'm going to start off on the bridge pickup. <laughs> So that is um, a little demo about the distortion sound. And of course, I'm going to show it on clean too. Um, I'm going to start off on the bridge humbucker. Pop it up all the way to the top, and you get a more bluesy sound. really great but it still has a decent clean sound. Um, well apart from that I'm going to talk to you about uh, personal experience and value for money right now because this is something they usually don't do and you know when you're buying your first guitar you would like to know if um, from people who, uh, who have this guitar and know a little bit about this guitar. Um, I'm going to start off with the price. Um, uh, I bought this guitar for 158 euros and that was in the time that the B Series one was really popular because nowadays I see them for around 200 euros, which is somewhere around 250 to 300 dollars. Um, about value for money, I think this guitar is good value for money. It's a pretty good guitar for its price, and um, you know it plays uh, surprisingly nice, and it sits really comfortable because um, people have been uh, bugging me about the distinct shape of this guitar and it makes it uh, really uncomfortable to sit with, but that's not true because as you can see it really fits perfectly into my right leg and if you want to um, rest the guitar on your left leg like so, you can see that this um, the cutaway right here fits perfectly into my right leg and as you can see my left, uh, the, this part of the guitar sits perfectly on the left leg so I don't need to support the guitar with my hands, I, you know, it sits really comfortable like this um, one of the bad things about this guitar is, because of course I have to talk about the downsides as well. Um, you know, you have the strap goes on right here, but you know, it's a really, uh, I don't think it was a great idea to put it right there, because when, it, when I lean the guitar to my chest, it really digs into my chest, which is not really that comfortable. So that's kind of a downside, I guess, as well as the tuners. Um, 
you know, they tend to slip a lot. And uh, I already had to change one of the tunings broke down, so this is a new one. But of course, you can't expect too much of this guitar since it's only 200 euros, so um, you have to deal with that. Um, other than that, I think it's a good guitar. It's a great guitar to begin with, especially for people who are looking for a low budget um, heavy rock and metal guitar. You know, if you're playing like blues or jazz, I, I suggest to find something else, even though it still has a decent clean tone. But um, for people who just started playing guitar or just looking for a cheap guitar that's made for metal and rock, I think this is a good decision and um, I like it a lot too. I still play on it even though I have a lot more expensive guitars. Um, you know, because it's just a surprisingly comfortable guitar and it's uh, fun to play on and of course, you know, it's a real eye catcher. I mean, come on, look at the shape. You know, it's not like you're not going to notice it. Um, so there, there you go. This is the BC Rich BK, uh, BC Rich Warlock BK Bronze 2. It's a long name. Um, I'm Guitar Sites, and I'll see you till next time.